Good morning, West Ottawa. I'm Kaylee. And I'm Patrick. And we have a great show for you today. And we're going to get it started. Mm, so let's go. All first semester textbooks must be returned before students will be able to check out textbooks for second semester. Textbooks can be returned in either library and should be returned by January 17th. The book room will be open the first week of the second semester to check out textbooks for new classes. Students must have their ID card and a copy of their schedule to check out a textbook. <coughs> Again, students will not be able to pick up second semester books if they have not yet returned books from the first semester. If you have any questions, stop by the library. Seniors, if you have received a scholarship this year, please email the name and the amount of the scholarship to Mrs. McLean or tweet at her at gowo underscore college. Don't miss Girl Rising, a meaningful and powerful movie that will make you value our education and give you a chance to make a difference in other people's lives. All proceeds go to Girl Rising for girls' education. Tickets are $2. Oh, oh, Come see Girl Rising to support girls who are not allowed to have an education. I feel as though I have power. January 17th at the West Ottawa Performing Arts Center from 6 to 8 p.m. Now there is nothing to stop me. Every girl deserves an education. I feel I can do anything. Come see Girl Rising. Attention all softball players. Hitting sign-up sheets will be in the athletic office starting Thursday, January 9. Hitting will be on Monday night starting January 13. Be sure to sign up. Open gyms will be available on Thursdays from 4 to 5 at Woodside. This will be after weightlifting slash conditioning with Coach Myers. Open gyms are for you to come hit, pitch, and throw. Rumor on the street is that the Wolfspresso Cafe and Grill is getting a few new additions soon. Let's go check it out. Hey, Wistano, I want to ask Mr. Togetsky to tell me a little more about the Wolfspresso Cafe and Lounge and how to treat it and what's to come for it. So let's go check it out. Um, so, you know, we've, this is really nice furniture, really nice space. We've got awesome uh, setup there. And we just really, we really need students to treat it like they would treat uh, a college-like atmosphere, uh, a coffee shop, um, and take care of it because it is very nice, uh, high-quality stuff, and we need it. Uh, we need people to take care of it. And if that happens, and we're going to continue to improve this area, we have a, a large-screen uh, TV coming for this area. We're going to have high-definition cable out here uh, for in the mornings, after school, during lunches. Um, a place that teachers can use with their classes. Uh, also around the corner uh, we've got some more furniture and we're going to be adding on to that area as well with a countertop uh, with stools uh, underneath it with some hookups so students can power up their devices. Um, and then you know we'll, we'll continue to add on to this area and if it goes well and if students treat it correctly and and continue to purchase uh, food and coffee, then hopefully in the future we can see one of these added to the North Building as well. Seniors, be sure to check the West Ottawa High School website under Guidance, then Scholarships for the latest hot scholarships list. Any juniors interested in prom committee should fill out an application online by Friday, January 17th. The link for the application is posted on the class Facebook page. Contact Anna, Anna Patchen, Jay McKinley, Miss Maspus, 
or Miss Horvartz if you have any questions. Well, that's all we have for you, Well. Have a good day and make sure you study for exams. Well, I've never seen a king or beast with quite so little hair.